Hello YouTube, Pastor Gold here, and I just want to say a few words about Margaret Thatcher, because some people have been saying that she doesn't belong on the £50 note. Well, let me tell you something. Margaret Thatcher was a saint. Oh yes, she was a wonderful lady. I'll never forget, back in 1985, she came to the Yorkshire village of Goldthorpe to close mine. And she shook all of our hands. And she gave my son one of her ice creams. And when she shook my hand, and look me in eyes, oh, I'll never forget. She had the most kind, generous, loving, forgiving, graceful, kind, kind eyes. She was a lovely, lovely lady. And if anyone deserves to be on £50 note, it's Margaret Thatcher. Some of you might be saying, but Pastor Gold, Margaret Thatcher closed mine down and put hundreds of workers out of work. They were unemployed because of her. Well, let me tell you something. It wasn't Margaret Thatcher's fault that mines got closed down. It was the fault of that nasty, vicious, commie, pink old bastard, Arthur Scargill. It was his fault that mines got closed down. Him and his flying pickets were evil scum. It was his fault that those miners lost their jobs and all the mines got closed down. Not Margaret Thatcher's. She had to close the mines down anyway because they were they were stinky, hideous death traps. She did those miners a favour closing them down. And some mean-spirited, lefty pinkles may be thinking, but Pastor Gold, didn't she unnecessarily sink the General Belgrano during the conflict with Argentina killing over 300 people? Well, let me tell you something. She had no choice. She had to sink that ship. She couldn't just let the Argies take our land. No. She had to teach them a lesson. She didn't have a choice. She had to sink it. Now, there may be some others who will be saying that Pastor Gold, wasn't she close friends with Jimmy Savile? That low life, that notorious paedophile? Well, give her a break. Lots of people were friends with Jimmy Savile in those days. They didn't know he was a hideous paedophile, and neither did Margaret Thatcher. How was she supposed to know that he was abusing young girls and boys? How was she supposed to know he was a necrophile and a paedophile? Give her a break. I'm sure if she was still alive today, she'd be first in line to condemn the man. But she didn't know back then, no one did. No, Margaret Thatcher is a saint and she deserves the glory of her face being printed on back of 50 pound notes for posterity, for future generations. Okay, that's all I've got for you today. So, God bless each and every one of you. 
And remember, listen to Pastor Gold. Always believe in your soul. Goodbye.